Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvanian toy collector and reviewer. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today we have ourselves a real treat from Transformers Cyberverse. And this is the Energon Armor. Skull Cruncher Energon Armor figure. Sorry if I repeat it myself, but this is a really good figure. Get some good wiggle went on the tail, which is pretty cool. But now we're going to look at the packaging itself. There we have Skull Cruncher in robot mode with his Energon Armor in artwork form. Another good picture of Skull Cruncher. Transformers Cyberverse Adventures, Bumblebee. And a nice product shot of Skull Cruncher in his robot mode. And him with the Energon armor. And his alligator mode, which is right here on the packaging, too. Made by Hasbro. And that's all there is to say for the packaging. Let's get down to the figure itself. He doesn't have much movement except for in the tail and uh, not much in the arms, I guess you could say. But that's pretty much all the articulation you get in alligator mode. And if you open this up, he has like a second mouth because of the Energon armor. And you can be like, oh, I'm going to eat some Autobot skulls personally. Ha ha ha. I like doing impressions a lot, and I have fun on these reviews. But now we're going to disconnect the gun and get Skull Cruncher in his robot mode. Disconnect the tail. Fold the legs out. And there we have almost the lower body done. Flip in these panels to form his legs. Rotate this down to form his chest. Rotate his arms. And rotate his elbows to reveal his robot mode fists. Let's take a close look at that noggin. And that is a really well-painted noggin. I don't know if you can make out the Decepticon symbol, but it's really well-painted. But now we're going to give Skull Cruncher his weapons. And this is kind of like based on the Titan's Return figure almost, which I do not have. Almost being the word, but I do not have the Titan's Return Skull Cruncher for those of you who know Skull Cruncher. I saw him in the Iaconis episode of Transformers Cyberverse. I had to add him to my Season 3 shelf. Articulation, he's got hinges that can hinge out that good. Full rotation joint. And a hinge for the elbows. Oh yeah, that's really good hinge work. And you can fold this part out on his tail and give him sort of an Alligator Blade. Now I'm going to slash you Autobots with my Alligator Blade. Slash. Because I am Skull Cruncher. And I like using voices for characters a lot, too, on this channel. It's fun. But now we're going to get down to comparison. I don't have a Skull Cruncher to compare this to. But here he is next to another bot that's basically an animal-based transformation. Here's Scorponok. Well, Energon Scorponok with Cyberverse Skull Cruncher. And they look good together, if I do say so myself. And that's how you kick on the Energon armor. And now he's got his skull, his Energon alligator armor. Thing. So yeah, that's the gimmick with this toy. Energon armor goes on him easily. You 
you're probably wondering, where did I get this figure from? Well, I got this figure from Amazon for about 10 bucks. Is he worth adding to your Season 3 Transformers? I'd say yes. Pick him up if you don't have the Titans Return Skull Cruncher. He is a good fill-in for that collection. And that's all there is to say for this video. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out.